I was arrested July 7th, 1961. About, I think it was about in the afternoon. And like I said, there were many of us there. And I think I stayed there for maybe uh, two or three days and we were put on the bus to Parchment, Mississippi. Where, we, where the females were going to be housed on death row, as were the males housed on death row. But it was completely different from ours. I can remember my ex-husband telling me, because he came, but before I did that, some of the things that they did to the men, we did not have to go through that. And he told me that they had them out there picking cotton and they were on uh, a work game and all that. And the females were not treated like that. But everything else that he talked about, we got the treatment. <coughs> Just, uh, I forgot to tell you that my parents did not know that I was going. And so what, <coughs> I didn't call them until I got in New Orleans. And when I called them and they asked me where I was, I told them that I was in New Orleans on my way to Jackson, Mississippi. Now, my parents are very spiritual, and um, I never heard my dad use language <laughs> like he used that time uh, when I called and told him uh, where I was. And I, he begged me to come home, and my mom said to me, i never forget it, Pat, you need to come home because your mouth is too big and it runs too much. You don't know when to shut up. You don't back down from stuff. And you're going to get yourself really, really hurt down there. And I told her, Mom, I, I just can't come home because I couldn't understand why people treated other black people the way they did. It didn't make any sense to me at all. I mean, these people down here, especially when we were going up on the bus, going to the bus, going to parchment, the people were so afraid, they were afraid to even wave at us. They would keep their hands by their sides and just kind of talk to us, not talk to us, but wave, wave to us. And um, I, I, you know, like I said, we didn't have that in Tucson, so I couldn't understand why. It, it was like that here. I mean, we're all made the same. We all have blood. We all have O negative, O positive, A, A, B. We, we, we just have the same everything. The only difference is I happen to be darker than the white person. So I told them I would take care of myself. I promised them that I would try and control my mouth and I would be home in about 30 days. 